All right, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to some more Raging Bites. My name is Raven from the Sky. Let's do this. Which way to go? Ooh. As per use. Switch back to the shoddy. Boom. Oh, he lived. Oh, I should just use the rock. Put over that. What is a Quentin Plex handgun? <laughs> Duplex, triplex, quantum plex. Five, but it uses five bullets. Jesus. Remodeled gun with five barrels. This surely takes the cake. Increased chance to critical hit. I don't know, man. <laughs> Ooh, you, it's like, mm-mm. It'd be seven bullets per person if I usually just use her her effect of increasing attack versus actually using her weapon. So I really don't really use her ranged weapon at all. Darts. Mm. Random. Is this a list of survivors who were here? Ben? My ex-wife and daughter's names are here. They made it here safely. But what happened to them after that? Ben, you have to maintain hope. She's right. Don't give up. This is a military facility, you know. It won't have gone down without a solid fight. This place may have fallen, but there might be other places that are still safe. That's true, they may have, uh, he said, yeah, I guess so. I mean, that's true, they may have evacuated. Went to another station somewhere. Shoot. Keep going. And head down. Oh my God. Get 
some XP. We could... There's this main. Uh, oh, that looks. That's gotta be readable. We gotta make it down there. And we could probably get. There's probably weapons in those caches. Scrawl note. Okay, this is the end. No one can escape their fate. I just heard a helicopter crash outside the base. On board were politicians and military industry executives. They were so proud that they stockpiled so many supplies here and yet. And yet? And yet what? I finally arrived at the military survivors camp. I can surely now rest easy. I was, however, warned not to go near the laboratory on base. I sometimes hear zombie groans coming from the lab. Could they be researching that cure that I heard about? While they may be subjects, I do feel uneasy having zombies on the base. I wonder is that what, how they got overrun? Maybe the zombies got out? This mofo. Uh, that, shoot. Oh no. Closing in. That's where we came. I think we got everything. <laughs> Slingshot. It's always one, ain't it?
boom. A lot of damage. Trying to grab and go, it didn't work. He's got to be open. Serum. Slowly getting some of the stuff that we use in that giant. Hopefully that's the last time we face that stupid giant. It's like four arms. Hey, Trey, this is the depot. Depot, I mean. And which way can we... Look like science is in here. I think one's gonna catch you. you can get through there without fighting him. I can see the sergeant charge me. Back up. Right, why didn't it? Not do much. 
Eh, yeah, it's still powerful. Let's put a shotgun. Back up. Ooh, critical. weapon. Ah, are those no? Are there no more decent people left? I can feel myself going mad with nothing but zombies around. From the look of this place, neither the military or the government seem functional. This is but one military ba base of many. There, are, there may be some useful information around. Somewhere. Gotta be something somewhere. Somebody might have left something behind. Like, you know what? Just in case someone comes here, they'll see this. Have you found some information? There are a bunch of reports that could have to be of use to us. Oh. First, astronaut transportation, stop. The first. It's a report on the first person infected with the zombie virus. The first person? Wait, I know that man. He was one of the astronauts on Saturn 13. Oh yeah, me too. He successfully set foot on the moon. Exactly. According to this, the infection originated from the lunar surface, meaning it came from the moon? It was a substance they came into contact with while working outside the ship. So he caught it and brought it back to Earth. Oh my gosh. All crew on board Saturn were confirmed to have been infected. For real? So you're saying this zombie infection originated from space? I suppose so. The fact that it came as a result of the Saturn project is a huge scoop. After all, it was a national project that everyone was thrilled about. 
so they must have covered up this information the entire time. While they took the time to develop that serum, no one was prepared for the panic that ensued. The government discovered trace amounts of a substance on the Earth's surface. A substance like the one that infected the Saturn crew. What does that mean? It indicates the danger of widespread infection via the environment. In, or, in other words, the government knew that zombies would soon take over the country. Rats! That's what it looks like. Yep. It says that they began developing the serum and a cure in response. A cure? So those rumors were true. Even so, they didn't make it in time. It's clear from the sheer devastation that a cure is nowhere to be seen. There are details on a mission assigned to the military by the government. It is regarding the first person infected by the zombie virus. It says they transported him to a research facility. Could it have been this one? Hey, quit kidding around. Don't tell me we unknowingly traveled all this way to be right in the middle of it. You know why I was desperate to come here. What, what if that big zombie was the first dude? But I don't think he was. He was remember he was in the, the um the bar. The microfilm. What what if I, um you know what? I'm starting to think that giant zombie was the first infected. This was the best option we had. Agreed. Hmm, what's this report? It's all over. The president said he would move the source of all this evil to another base. But he didn't return after going to the lab. Meanwhile, this entire facility is in disarray. <laughs> this is the start of something catastrophic. I've read enough. It's clear the government didn't stand a chance against this infection. This military base of all places has fallen. It's too late. Even after struggling all the way here in the hope that I'd find Mina, she's nowhere to be seen. Only zombies. Take a deep breath, Ben. We still haven't looked everywhere, right? Even though this one has fallen, other bases could still be safe. And we have proof here that the development of a cure was at least started. No. It's all over. I understand how Chad felt now. The feeling of wanting to end everything while still a human. I know. We could launch that nuclear missile. That would end all this suffering. Maybe that's the reason we all ended up here. Are you listening to yourself, men? He's gone mad. The whole world's gone mad. As the last sane people on the planet, it's our duty to end everything. I never expected this from you, man. I found some information that will bring you back to your senses, Ben. It looks like some people escaped this base. And your ex-wife and daughter are on the list of those who supposedly did. Really? The escape plan was led by the commander of this base, Commander Anderson. I found some of his records. He prioritized women and children. As for the method of getting them to safety, it seems that he wanted to use the six military helicopters on the roof of this facility. I do hope his plan succeeded. So maybe Mina and my ex-wife got away safely. I don't believe it. Thank you, Lord. I'm so happy for you, Ben. There's some hope for you, brother. Come on, man. <laughs> exactly. You took the words right out of my mouth, dude. Read the room. Let's finish this dude off. Um, okay, so he's just a normal zombie. He's not a boss. Boss character. Looks like a load of zombies await us. That zombie earlier was somewhat different from all we've seen so far. Yeah, it was really tough. Could it have something to do with the origins of all this? Either way, we can't afford to cower in fear. 
To get to the heliport on the roof, we need to head through the, a research lab. It'll be rough going. Make sure to be fully prepared. Gotcha. Look at all this. What's in this room? Okay. So we have to go all the way around. These are just rooms in front of us. Darn it. Serum. <laughs> Excuse me. So we went through all that just for serum? Ah, shoot! Knock your butt up. Oh, one hit a quitter. Boss waiting at the, on the roof. More serum. See ya. Maybe it's a game's where it tells we're gonna need it. If you don't get out of the
Why? Thousand forty. Man, he, he is strong, man. I mean, he's a rock. He's a germ. Ball with him. What's with these ones? They're not attacking us. Looks like they're protecting something. Somebody pinch me. <laughs> I never saw such cool looking wef weaponry on my tours. Helen, I found some good news and some bad news. I can see the bad news, but I'm not sure what the good news is. <laughs> that the president himself was fighting on the frontiers of this catastrophe? Wow. I could make an inspirational article out of that. We're dead. <laughs> oh my god. I probably should use the um those quad pistols too. Got enough ammo now. God, these things are strong. I just wanna test the waters real quick. How strong is he? He's really bad. What I'm gonna do, we'll attack the first two and I'll have him shoot El Presidente back there with a thousand attacks. Slime, I guess they're the, the Secret Service agents, I think. The bodyguards. Zombie president. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh. That kind of use the shotgun to see what that does. Really. It hit them both. It hit all of them, really. Man, man, they, they are strong. I think that's what I'm gonna do is just focus on him. Cause if, if he gets close. He kept giving us serums. Can't have to do anything, man. Let me just try it. Oh, oh no. Oh no. his attack. Gonna switch back. I know it hits all three, but I'm so sick of that.
No! Ah! That was the wrong one! I didn't mean to hit him. Take out one of these guards. Almost! Shoot! Take out at least one of them. He keeps healing them, man! I'm gonna take him out of here. Oh! What? We're down to one. Them weapons where you do, they do multiple shots, it's gonna use a lot of ammo, but shoot. Grapple does it. My God. Ground swinging. <laughs> Gotta have these. <laughs> I'm so busy trying to hit him with the, the most powerful guns I have. Weapons, make sure. See ya. Oh, my God. You guys do not know how long that took. I can't believe we killed the president. That would have been the worst crime imaginable if it wasn't a zombie. That sure was a heated battle. Oh, yes, it was. It really felt like he wanted to defend the country. <laughs> it's surprising how much living consciousness seems to survive the turning process. Which explains why they can use weapons again. So they made it make sense. It's just, it's a bit annoying. The heliport from which Commander Anderson planned to evacuate Mina. 
We should be almost there. Let's go. Uh, I, I gotta do that. Anything else in here before we leave? Can we even get on the lift? Like some secret down there? I guess English grammar doesn't survive the turning process. Maybe it was an attempt to stay sane in the early stages of infection? It's terrible here too. Look, an important looking plan seems to be left open on the computer over there. finished report is still open on the screen. The foreign spy who stole the film of the original infection samples is being dealt with. A suspicious CIA worker who goes by the alias Shark is under investigation for treason. It looks like someone tried to leak news of the infection early on, but they failed and look what happened to the country since. But there are still survivors, like your family. Yeah, I guess. Let's go. The heliport is just a little further. We should be at the roof soon. Is that blood? Be careful, Ben. It looks dark in there. And I'm gonna stop it here for today, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for watching. My name is Raven from the Sky. If you enjoyed the episode, drop a like and subscribe to the channel. The series grow. Take care, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Peace.